ladies, you too. Any ladies who want to be Clarissa Chalk, Kelsey Campbell, please come up. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll start off with uh, Baba Booya, Jake Herbert. I just wanted to thank everybody for all the help, uh, all the dedication, all the endless nights. And I know you guys stayed up um, in supporting our dreams. You know, not every single person up here reached their goal until we come up and we have seven, you know, men gold medalists, four women, and seven Greco. That's when we reach our goal as a wrestler. And um, the most important thing is that we're all better because of the journey. You know, until we get seven goals up here, you know, we're all living through Jordan Burroughs. We're all living through Jake Barner. You know, we're living through people like Coleman and Chris who battle all the way back and get a bronze medal. So we want to thank you guys for your endless support and allowing a group of kids like us to, to have a chance. Um, and that's, you know, the chance to chase down our dreams. Thank you guys. Good job. It, it, it ain't nothing without the big heavy, heavyweight. So you get it done in Times Square, and continue to get it done for America. To Val and to Uh Yeah, I mean, Jake said really well. I don't know what else to say. But, um, yeah, thanks so much for all your support. And uh, I know we're uh, a group of guys excited, and, and ladies, and uh, we're just ha happy to go on. So uh, God bless. Well, uh, well, he is a Michael Jordan wrestler, so he could actually grab the bike, but Gold Mellis, the man, Jordan Burroughs. Uh, yeah, just want to thank you guys again, you know, so it's an, it's an awesome honor to be here. I'm super proud of everyone up on the stage. You know, we did a lot of training together, and we all come from separate parts of the country, you know, but once we had that camaraderie and brotherhood, throughout the summer, running up that cog, doing sprints. Jake Barner wasn't there though, but uh, <laughs> it was good, it was good time, you know, so we, we really created a brotherhood. We had an awesome time together, bled, sweat, and, and, and shed blood together, you know, so it was awesome. Happy to be a gold medalist. Hopefully we have a lot more gold medals in the future in 2016. And uh, I'm, I'm in it, I'm in it. These guys are in, I'm in, and America's behind me. Go yes. Uh, Sam Hayes Winkle and uh, these guys have been, been, been saying it perfect. And, uh, the only thing I would add is uh, I see a lot of resolve in this room. I, I know uh, the guys up here that, like myself, that didn't reach our goal, we got resolve to, to make it happen. And I see these guys that got the goal, you can, you can see the resolve in their eye to do it again. And, and I look out here and I, and I see resolve in your guys' eyes to, to help us out to reach these goals. And uh, I, I think that's what we need, and it's going to push us in the right direction. And that's one of the founding things with the USA. That's that's what we do. We resolve to do something. We make it happen, and it's going to happen. Go USA! <laughs> Olympic champion. <laughs> I look kind of like that. <laughs> hold that. Here he is. Hold on. Hold that. Oh, you don't get it yet. First of all, Jordan, you know I don't run. <laughs> um, yeah. uh, I, I want to thank you all for being here. You know, it's it's not easy uh, doing what we do without your support. And, you know, that just makes it a lot easier for us. A lot stress, more stress free. And um, just just thank thank you a lot for that. And, uh, you know, just to kind of touch on what Jake said. Um, you know, they're talking about living through me, Jordan, Coleman. You know, we, we, we live through you guys too. We all live kind of through each other. You know, it's, I'll tell you one thing, it's probably the hardest thing to sit in the back when we're not wrestling and, and watch these guys. And, and when they lose a match, or win a match, you know, we get into it too. We get to watch how emotionally involved we get because, you know, we still have to wrestle. And, uh, and it's hard when you know, I see these guys not accomplish what they want to accomplish how hard they work, you know, it's, it's hard not to be emotional about it, but, um, you know, I just want to thank these guys, these guys are awesome, you know, I couldn't do nothing I do without these guys, and, you know, I love these guys, and, you know, we're going to have some, we're going to have some fun in the next few years, thanks everybody. Thank you. Uh, like Jake said, you know, we're, we're a great team, we got along great uh, this year, and, and I think that was a key 
component uh, component in us uh, doing well at the Olympics. Uh, you know, we 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 wanted to wrestle for each other, not just for ourselves. And uh, we wanted to wrestle for our country. And I, I think we showed it. And uh, I was inspired um, watching Jordan win his gold medal, and then being there when Jake won his. You know, and, and it just made me want to wrestle wrestle harder after seeing that. Uh, you know, and, and like they said, we couldn't do it without you guys. Um, you know, I, 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 there's a few individuals in here I know that helped me personally through my, my last couple of years. And, um, it was a rough, you know, couple of years and uh, for me personally. And uh, you know, I went from third in the country to third in the world in, in a year. Uh, so it was an up and down year. You know, and, and I couldn't have done it without these guys and everybody behind me. Uh, you know, and that's that's what you know that's what put it. For me, that's what winning that medal was for, was for everybody else, not, not really for me. So thank you guys. And I, I also want to just thank everyone here and, and, and just the other wrestlers up here, because I think, you know, for me and for a lot of us here, we didn't we did reach our goals uh, in London. And, you know, we have four more years to get ready for that, but I got to say that in spite of the goals I didn't reach, it was just awesome to be able to celebrate your victories with you. Um, I mean, it truly, for me, it was, it was what got me through the games. To see you guys achieve what you did. It was super inspiring to see my teammates achieve what they did. And um, it, it, there's a fire there. It's not just a distant dream anymore. It's a reality. And, and I've been there. And, and I want to be there again. And I want to fulfill my end. You guys have done so much. And I think now it's, now it's up to us to fulfill our end. For those of us who won the goal to do it again, and for the rest of us, to get a goal. So thank you and uh, on to the next one. <laughs> I feel like it's going to be redundant after all this stuff. <laughs> but for me, I just want to thank everyone. You know, like everyone that supported me from or been cheered me on, you know, or like just been there from day one. That's how I felt, you know, like some people call it a redemption for my match because I was in a situation where it wasn't so easy your first time around in the Olympics when you went to go look. <laughs> you know, it, it was my struggle, you know, like my own personal struggles and battles within myself. And I felt the support that you all have given me, like anyone who's been there for me. Words of encouragement, you know, someone that touched me physically, mentally, everything, you know, um, that drove me to fight that much harder, you know, not just for myself, 